What is going on YouTube? This is Nick with Hilltop TCG back again with another video. Today guys, we are ripping a new box from Costco. What is going on Hilltop TCG family? Guys, that is right. Today we have a five pack mini tin box from Costco guys. This is the newest addition to the ever growing Costco lineup that is officially from Pokemon, but made for Costco. So, um, today we're going to see if this product is worth the value. Um, see if you need to go pick it up, help you guys as a consumer decide if you want to or not. I front those dollars. You know what I mean? Looking out for you guys. All right. So let's take a look at Costco because you guys can actually go buy these right now at Costco guys. So right now, these are $39.99 on the Costco website. $39.99. You can actually buy these in store. When I bought them, they were $37.99. $37.99 for five mini tins um, and some promos. So if you're ever so inclined, go do it. You got to spend a couple extra bucks on there. But um, yeah, they're, they're accessible on the Costco website right now. So my thing is, there was a massive pallet. Let's, let's go to the box real quick, and then we're gonna go back to online, and we'll uh, we'll we'll do some we'll do some math. We're gonna do some research right here. So let's take a look at this box real quick. So we have the five mini tins. Awesome display. I mean, I love this little Gyarados up here. Um, we're gonna have to take a look at that one because that one is sweet. So they add in the little hollow foils. Um, this is definitely an official Pokemon International product. A bunch of Costco little stamps right there. So it's just saying Costco made it, but basically right here. You get the Paldea Mini Tin Friend Tins. You get um, two pack booster packs in each tin. You get five tins, and then you get um, all those promos on the front. So, $37.99 for five tins, guys. Um, these are supposed to cost $12 a piece. So, the average person would say, okay, these were supposed to cost $12 a piece. That's way more than $38, right? Um, great. But, let's go back to online real quick. Go back to online. And we're gonna go to TCG Player. So the Paldea Friends Mini Tin Display, you can buy 10 mini tins for $58. So that means each of these mini tins cost you $5.80 a piece. These are supposed to be $12. They cost you $5.80. The ones in Costco, you get five of them for $38. Math-wise, I think that's slightly over $7.50 a mini tin. So you're spending basically $2 extra buying them from Costco than just going to TCG Player and buying the mini tin display there. So guys, why is the math working out like this? Um, to be honest with you, let's get back onto this box. This box was, um, there was a lot of them there and they've been sitting there for several weeks. I personally even passed by them, not even thinking to do a video because I saw what tins were in them. Um, and I knew that the tins were hard for us to sell as a shop um, all together, so why would I go buy them, right? So I said, you know what, I gotta go buy, buy a box so the consumer on YouTube can be a, like informed as much as they can, right? So great mini tins. Um, again, why, let's get all these promos out real quick. Why, oh Gyarados, Ew. Why would they, I mean, it's supposed to be $12, right? So yeah, they're like, oh yeah, we're saving beat people a bunch of money charging them basically $7.50 a tin. And that would make sense a lot of the time if the tins had good packs in them. The consumer is smart, guys. So there, there definitely were some that um, sold since when I looked at them a couple weeks ago until when I went and picked these ones up. But the typical consumer, I think, is, you know, a mom buying little Timmy their Pokemon box. But the reality is there's a lot of grown adults buying Pokemon these days. So they use the internet, they look up the product, they see if it's a worth it value. They did the math like I did and said, you know what, I can go buy these tins for cheaper on TCG Player. And why are the tins so cheap? Well, let's get into it. Maybe I'll be pleasantly surprised, but I don't think I'm gonna be. We got sticker sheet, we got this, we got Scarlet and Violet base and Silver Tempest. That's actually really good. Um, the other tins that I opened had Scarlet and Violet Base and Paldea. So that's actually a great surprise. This is this is a good surprise. So 
Um, any anything sword and shield era, I will be ecstatic about. I'm gonna get these other four tins and we'll keep talking. All right, guys, I got all the mini tins open. I mean, this was a great surprise. Silver Tempest, Scarlet and Violet base. The last ones that I ripped had Paldea Evolved and Scarlet and Violet in them. So that's a great little curveball to be thrown at me. I'm excited. Hopefully, hit some type of Lugia action or something. But I just wanted to highlight that that. This is kind of the first Costco product that I was like, huh, like that wasn't like the craziest value because usually the Costco products are such a great value that they fly off the shelf. And in the past, they've had like evolving skies. They've had very desirable packs for people. So, um, and kind of like I said, the, the average consumer, I think of Pokemon these days, especially like at Costco, isn't a mom shopping with their kid and picks them up a box. It is grown adults going and buying Pokemon for themselves or for the family. And they look, they do the research and they make sure they're getting a, a solid deal, right? So that's why um, I wanted to show you guys that, that you could, you just got to make sure, be a wise, a wise um, purchaser, I guess, and make sure to check the internet, you know, price check, because if you really wanted these, by all means, go do it. It has some great pack selection, but if you wanted just the mini tins, you can go buy them for basically $2 less online right now. And I mean... Just to, just to be transparent, wow, Scarlet and Violet base, nothing there. I mean, $58 for a mini tin display, that is definitely costing the company that's selling those a lot of money. They're losing, they're probably losing $20 to $30 after shipping on each of those mini tins. That they're willing to go to that price to just move inventory, which is pretty, pretty crazy in the new world of Pokemon. Am I going to just talk shade on this box, this whole video, and then... I get absolutely nothing. 100% deserved the, Pal the Paldea Mini Tin Friend Tins or whatever we want to call them. They were like, yeah, I'll show you what, Nicholas. Maybe we'll spike a Lugia of some sort here in the last three packs, guys. So, I mean, $37 for, hey, we got a Arcanine. $37 for 10 packs, $3.70 a piece. Um, I already told you, you can get them cheaper. You can go buy them on Costco online right now. I mean, if you like the promos, that Gyarados is almost worth it for me to go buy. Because it is super cool that Hall of Foil sparkly edged Gyarados. All right, guys, last pack magic. And right there, there you go. Five mini tins with an Arcanine V to show for it. Right there, guys, a solid dollar card for a $38 product. I mean, Costco's done a lot better, right? And again, be an informed consumer. If you want these tins, I guarantee there's probably plenty of awesome hits out there to be had. Probably some Lugia Alt Arts hide in. Worth it to go buy these. I mean, go get that deal on TCG Player. Get it for $58 shipped to your door, guys. Crazy deal. Um, again, it's up to you guys if you want to go buy it. I'm going to rip it for you so you guys know to go buy or to not to buy. It's up to you. But all right, if you guys made it to the end of this video, you're an absolute legend. Have a great night, weekend, whatever's for you. Peace.